School North students have become the target of cyber bullying, and we have just learned that Avon police have identified the person claiming responsibility for the page. Uh, still, parents are concerned that things like this page could lead to their child harming themselves. CBS 4's Erin Cantrell explains. Hudson was the kind of kid who, who loved everyone. He'd, he'd give it, anyone an opportunity uh, to be friends with or to build a relationship with. Wesley Scott's son Hudson was 14 when he took his own life. His dad says Hudson fell into a deep depression after constantly being bullied by his peers. His note that he left us that it was just, you know, this was a world he didn't want to be a part of anymore. The constant hate and judgment passed on by others. It's what multiple students at Avon Middle School North are now dealing with. Parents say a social media account is posting photos of students with disparaging comments and rumors. And now they worry it could lead to kids harming themselves. Kids don't always have the knowledge of the actions that they need to take. Um, and they may be feeling really alone and isolated in these situations. Jenny Volker is a clinical social worker at Community Health Network. She says cyberbullying is more common than people realize and points out there are things parents can watch for. Parents are the experts on their children. They know when their behaviors change or their mood is different. So that's when you can seek out uh, professional support. And Volker stresses it's important for parents to step in and have conversations. Really taking the time to listen to their child's experience, to their feedback. Um, this is not a conversation to have um, in a busy public place. This is a conversation to have in private and to have the time to really listen to what's going on with your child. Reporting in the newsroom, Erin Cantrell, CBS 4 News. Erin, thank you. And as we said, police have identified the person who is claiming responsibility for the post. Parents told us that the social media account has been taken down several times, but new ones just keep popping up. The school district encourages parents to report any account being used to bully their child. We have resources for parents for dealing with cyberbullying in Aaron's store.